And we are back in the saddle again. Take your crystal. See what we get. Money in the bank, baby. You, Officer Crystal, I will grant you the light up that banishes evil. All right, thank you. Bench that evil people. Boom. Is she thick? She a thick boy. Is she a thick boy? LOL. <laughs> hey, you know, it's 2020. Let's go. She can be a thick boy if she wants to be. <laughs> Freebie? Or you, you could be another trick. Last time we got a trick, remember that one? Topaz, I'll take it. Alright, good, it's a freebie. Well, it wasn't a freebie. Oh, yeah. Shoot, might as well just save up and get two hearts. Three more shrines. I'm sure we'll find that. No problem. I do want to hit that star island, though. Hopefully we can fly over there. Get our car. I'm sure we can. Between the plane and our glide ability, our stamina, tolling, we got this. Oh, unless it takes my plane and decides to be a dick, which it did. Why would it do that to me? What is that over there? Yeah, oh, it's just one of those guys. Okay. Uh, where is that star island? I really do want to check that star island out. So, it's north, east. Is it over there? It. Let me double check. No, it's a little more this way. Oh, it's right there. Oh, okay. Man, there's a lot of stuff to do over here. I just want to beat the game, man. Just let me beat the game. That's close enough. You gotta hurry. Come on, Tolan, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Tolan, 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 Tolan's got our back, Tolan's got our back, come on, Tolan. Is this another one of those things that falls? It is one of those things that's gonna fall. That we can't read. Man, it's another one of those can't read things. Where's the fairy at? Uh, the, oh, well, we're close to the ferry, and then there's another temple there. I'm sure we'll have to do the bottom anyways. Well, let's see what it does. It's etched with an ancient Hylian text. You cannot read it. Oh, it's not going to fall? Maybe I have to read that one that Painter was talking about first. Alright, um... So, it's straight south from here. So, right there. Should see a bulb somewhere. Wow, look at that. There's two shrines right there. We're coming up. Oh, we got to pass this hill. It's way over there. Well, we'll hit that shrine. We could just jump that gap. We could totally make that gap. We do have a ways to go. We'll do a little falling. Come on, Tolan boy, you got this, my little man's. Do a little more falling. Hey, there's the ferry right there. Oh, uh, we probably don't need the ferry, actually, right? We don't need to talk to the ferry. We just need to talk to uh, the people in the old. Uh... There it is, right there. Okay, yeah. 
how are we gonna find the next musician in this weather? Oh, and there's pony boys. We got the boys hanging out over there, guys. There we go. Okay, we gotta land. Okay, we'll hit this ride. Get paid. That was a horrible shot. Well, at least he can't shoot much better. There, take that. Take that in your pants. Take that all up in your pants. So I wonder if their breezer's up and running. Place your bets. You think it's up and running? It probably is. It's probably like, this is gonna be the one where the breezer's running. The musician's on standby. We just basically have to walk up and listen to a song. Right? Right? That's that's totally the way it's gonna be. We got this. We better got this. It's a whole new world. Come on. Why am I singing that song? <laughs> Probably because this is so exciting. Come on. Jeez, look at this. What are we doing? This is easy. Obviously, we open this door. Piece of cake. And then, to get around these, what we're going to have to do is run around the side here and see what kind of goodies they left us. Okay, there's this guy. Ow, that was my face. How dare he do that to my face? Okay, and then we're gonna go up here. We're gonna take the ladder up. Go around here. Do a U turn. Uh, what in the world? We're gonna crawl in here. Okay, and then we're gonna go down, back in the front here. It looks like we're gonna have to do a little glide action, right? We can't climb this, we can't climb that. Okay, so we're gonna have to glide down, go around all of that, open this door, get this chest. <laughs> Ta-da! How you guys like that picture? Five arrows? Yeah, not bad. Boom. A couple of those. Wooden shields. Could be handy, but uh, what's my motto? We're lazy. Okay, so this one's super easy. Ow! We just get around that guy. Walk through here like this. This guy's gonna throw a rock and we're gonna beam him in the arm. We're gonna freaking smash him. Oh yeah, we got this. 100% walk through just like this. Here we go, here we go. This guy's gonna catch us. We're gonna block. And then we're gonna get, get hit right in the head. Perfect, perfect. And then we're gonna land on the road. Smack him. So, ow. Could you guys take care of that, please? Uh, thank you. I love you guys, but you guys really need to chill your roll, okay? Okay, fellas? Uh, we just going up and in? Is that all there is to it? Really? Any day now. I mean, we could have just taken the, the beam through, but whatever. Whatevs. Okay, now we're up top. Now there's another hole for another rock. There's two rock holes. Two rock holes. Okay, one plus one equals two. Two rock holes. Where are these rocks? Okay, I have to open that door somehow. What's in here? There's a metal grave. You can't get the metal grave. 
Oh my lord, this is a toughie. funny stuff. So we were meant to fall. That's hilarious. L oh freaking L. Small key. Okay. Yay. That was silly. They made us do all that and have to fall in. Those scheming little tricksters. Who would have thought we'd have had to do that? Alright. Give me my ball. Get the ball over there. I was just gonna throw the ball over there. But whatever. We'll take the plane. Why not? Okay. I believe we've gotten everything. I guess they gave us the fun way to get the ball down. <laughs> That's all that was. Oh, big stretch. Big stretch. <sighs> Ouch. Too much stretch. Six. See that, guys? Two more. Boom. We're ready. We're going to have so many hearts, we're not even going to know what to do with them. So many hearts. Hey, and it's daytime. Thank goodness. All right. What's up with the flute troop? Still calling them the flute troop. The stable trotters. Hmm. Ah, we meet again. Did you come to see the great fairy? Great fairy? Yes, indeed. The great fairy Maja settled close to the snowfield stable. There she is. Alas, the great fairy is hiding in her flower bud. She's too frightened to come out, just like her sister at a uh, woodland stable. Yeah. The great fairy always liked the timber of Eustu's horn, so I thought I'd calm her nerves with the soothing toodles. Uh, Eustu is a young man who plays the horn for the stable trotters. Hey. But one day he split off from the troop and no one has seen him since. Aww. There was one traveler who came from Tabantha Bridge Stable far south of here who heard the sound of, like a horn, but 
it came from a place well past the other end of the Tabantha Great Bridge, somewhere along that road. No. But that's far away. Oh, Eastus, where could you have gone? Okay. Sweet. And we're off. That's it. Oh, do we do one of these? Dare we tango? One more time, please. Guys, what do you think? Oh, shit, guys. I don't know. Okay, fine. Ah. Your story is really something. Mind going through it again just to make sure I have all the details right. Oh. Sure, no problem. Uh, we've been taking care of very, uh, very rare animals for Princess Zelda, a golden horse. But the poor thing ran away from our stable. Mm. Hmm, Princess Zelda horse vanished? Like, that's a pretty big story, but tell me again, why would that horse run off? Oh. That's the troubling part, isn't it? When it happened, I had finished tending to the horses and was taking a bit of a rest in the stable. Then that gentle creature began making terrible sounds, uh, neighing and bucking around so hard it shook the stable. So you went outside to see what was wrong, didn't you? Yes, exactly. And there she was, Princess Zelda. After all this time, she was right in front of our stable. But then Princess Zelda, Princess came closer and the golden horse thrashed harder. Aww. Then that animal broke free and bolted away like nothing ever, like I've, nothing I've ever seen before. I couldn't help staring at that crazed creature and when it looked back at the princess, she was just gone. It happened so fast. So you lost sight of the horse and then Princess Zelda vanished on the spot. That's strange from the start to finish. My little sources tipped me off of this, but I have to say, I thought it was going to turn out to be nothing much. Hey partner, you're here. I should have known it was you there. Just look at you, tiptoeing up like this is Getting your ear in. Uh, you've got the makings of a real reporter. Oh. oh, this is someone else from the newspaper. Oh, That's right, new partner. Plenty of gusto and a lot of promise. Would it be alright if he listens in? Now please, tell us anything else you can remember. Anything at all. The part that really bothers me is the poor animal acting that way. That horse truly loved the princess, so rescued in a protected it, so she rescued and protected it. She dotted on it. Dotted on it. She dooted on it. She dooted on it, guys. She dotted on it. I have no clue. Uh but the horse was terrified, and for the life of me, I can't understand why. Eh? Princess Zelda is known far and wide for her compensation, uh, compassion, and I can't imagine our princess being terrifying at all. Mm -hmm. Oh, hold on. I think I did catch the briefest glimpse of Princess's face. I thought I could have seen that right but she had such a cold expression she'd been full of warmth when she's been here before maybe the princess was furious that I let the horse get away uh -huh. I really should find that animal and bring it back here for her uh -huh. that poor horse galloped north and never looked back I'd go and search for the steed, but the huge monster that's flying around up north is far too dangerous for me. The best I can do is keep the horse home here in the stable, nice and clean, just in case it returns. Keep the horses. Oh, okay. Sai, I just hope someone finds that sweet creature and brings it back here safely. Alright. Well, we are in search of the stable trotters right now, so, uh... Whoa, way down there. Okay, what is this? 
Uh, what is that? I put a stamp there, some something there. All right, well, let's go here. And there's a hole here. That's promising. It's always nice to see a little bit of a hole, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you just need a hole in your life. Just a nice little hole. Or dark and gloomy hole. You know, whatever. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Nasty. Guys, don't step in that. It's not good for you. Alright, so we've got windmills. Boy, we do have a little bit of a track, don't we? We're headed straight in this direction. Okay. We got this. We got this. No problem. Let's do a little glidey poo. Man, I miss our other wind ability. I like being able to shoot up. Speaking of shoot up, uh, let's just go ahead and do that. Uh... Drop one of these. And let's equip our shield we want. This one. Oops, not quite. Okay, and we're headed right there. This ought to get us there in a hurry. Maybe. Well, at least it saved us some of that time. Come on, Tolan, you can do it. Let's go, boy. Yeah, good job, Tolan. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. There's windmills all the way down there. Hey, at least we saved some of the climb. Gosh, it keeps just a little faster. That might be the first up ability I upgrade. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. Sidon's pretty bad, though. Bad A, you know what I'm saying? I like Prince Sidon. He gets in there. He's like, whoop, whoop, I mean, Tolan does too, though. So, like, Tolan's ability is a little handier. Good job, guys. You just keep taking him down. Take him down. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Yeah. Gonna shoot the puppies. You want some of this? Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought, little puppy. I'm tempted just to make us a car. What's up there? Just falling from the sky. Alright, I'll meet you guys there unless something happens. We're here, it's just right around the bend. Alright, what's this fella gonna need? I'm like, I need 80,000. Oh, I hear. I hear a trumpet. I'm in a real bind. What do you need? Oh, uh, hey. Did you come down here to rescue me? Yes, I did. Oh. So I used to play uh, play horn with the stable trotters. It's true. They need you, bro. What? The great fairy went into hiding, and so the troop is looking for me. Well, from bad to worse. Uh, have you heard how Rito Village north of here is struggling to get enough food? It really breaks my heart. Oh no, they're good, bro. You've been out of the loop for a while. <laughs> The Rito were always good to us when our music troupe was touring the kingdom. Oh. So when I heard about the fierce blizzard tearing into Rito village, I couldn't just sit and do nothing. I slipped away from the troupe and made for the village with supplies and songs to ease their burdens. Oh, what a nice guy. I got my wagon and got at, uh, oh my god. I got my wagon going at a quick trot on this road, but then suddenly drove into this hole. I didn't use, I didn't use to be here. <laughs> I didn't uh. use to be here, yeah. 
The horse I was riding ran off somewhere and my cargo has spoiled. The only thing I have left is the wagon. I didn't know that while I was stuck in this hole, the great fairies went into hiding and my troop reformed. It sounds like I should get out of this hole and join back up with the stable trotters as soon as I can, but Ooh. I can't climb up the side of this hole, not without my wagon. At least I'd rather not leave it behind. Aww. I'm relieved that someone came to rescue me, but I hope you have a plan to free me from this hole. Okay, so he can't leave his wagon behind? Uh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Okay. Two balloons? So, do we... We need to make a train? A love train of, uh... Balloons. Alright. Alright, guys. I will build it, and you will see. And we're back. Uh, hopefully this isn't overkill. I used uh, one flame emitter of my own and also the control module since we got a bunch of them. Still got 15 left. So I only put one fan on it. Oh dude, there was another flame emitter right here. Oh well, who cares? We can go always get more. We got tons of stuff. So let's talk to him and see if he can get in. Huh. I can't climb the wall. Oh man, I can't climb up the wall of this hole and even if I could, I wouldn't want to leave my wagon. Mm. Uh, if only someone could pull my wagon out of the hole with me in it. Okay, get in the wagon. <laughs> what? You can actually make this happen? Yes, I can. <sighs> All right, then. Let's hope you know what you're doing. Mm. There we go. Let's hope I know what I'm doing, oh! too. I'm in the wagon, ready to go. Oh man, I didn't think this through. Uh, oh, here we go. Get in, hang on. What the heck? There we go. Whoa, I'm out of the hole. That was it. <laughs> it was overkill. But you know, guys, come on. It was cool. <laughs> Woo, I'm finally out. I got so nervous, I fogged up my glasses and missed what you did. Uh. But you did it. Uh, you actually did it. Thank you so much. If you hadn't come along, I don't know how much longer I would have been stuck in that hole. Come to think of it, I haven't made such a rash decision during the earliest days of the upheaval. Uh... If I hadn't made such a rash decision during the earliest days of the upheaval and ran off on my troop, maybe things would have ended up, maybe things wouldn't have ended up this way, blah, blah, blah. I mean, the supplies I collected to help feed the Rito village have all spoiled by now anyways. Oh. I should get back to the stable trotters and rejoin my bandmates. That will do more good. For the time being, I should head to Snowfield Stable and play my horn for the Great Fairy there. Oh. oh, one more thing. Take this, please. It's a cooking ingredient I picked up from my travels. Uh, this is the least I can do for you getting me out of there. Hey, nice. Cool, some bee honey. Coarser bee honey. Huh. Yeah. And now, uh, I know I'd be on my way. Okay. I'd be better on my way. Uh, why don't you come to the Snowfield Stable to... and hear us perform? Sure. Let's go. That's exactly the plan. Uh, boom. Back at the stables again. Alright, what's wrong with Breezer this time? Hello, hello, 
I know you, Traveler. We've had a delightful development. Look! I mean, listen. It's Istus. He, uh, he and his horn are back in our troop. It's heartbreaking to hear of the poor fellow getting stuck in that hole on the way to Rito Village. Note to self, Isis doesn't get to drive the cart anymore. Uh, but I'm glad he's out of his funk and fit as a fiddle. Isis' horn will blow the stable trotters back on course. Uh, now that Isis is here, we can bring the sound of his horn to the Great Fairy. It would be wonderful if we could go and perform for her right away. But of course, there's always something holding up the show. No, no. Our breezer's roof is broken, so we'd be at the mercy of the elements. Just look at the snow falling. We might fall in such weather and... How could we perform at our best then? I did try to attach a roof to Breezer. Alas, I couldn't reach high enough to do more than set up some poles. If we could put a roof on Breezer, our performance for the Great Fairy as is as good as canceled. Oh, okay. Ugh, what would we do? Uh, where the hell is Breezer? I'm lost. Oh, she's right there. Alright, so they just need a roof. How big of a roof? It looks like these will work. <laughs> Hold on, I want to... Oops. Just like that, that's what I want. I know, it's probably easier than what I'm doing, but... Is there one more? I might as well put one more on. Guys, it's the best roof, okay? You know it is. Beautiful. We simply must put on a performance to the Great Fairy. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, I'll take you. Did I hear you say you would take us to where the Great Fairy awaits? But for that, we, we'd have to... What's this? Our breezer has been fitted with the roof. Uh, the world hasn't abandoned us. Uh, I'll never forget your kindness. I accept your offer. All aboard, everyone. We're all aboard. On the road to Great Fairy starts by going around from the left and climbing a little ways up the mountain. I'll leave the rest to you, good sir. Okay, well let's get our horse. Which horse do we need? Hi. Thanks for coming in such bad weather. Hello. Welcome. You've reached Snowfield Stable. Uh -huh. Thank you for your support, the Stable Association. Since this is your first time here, we'll add one point to your pony points. Reward available. Oh. oh, it looks like you've got some pony points saved up, Link. 
If you want to get your reward, step inside the counter and we'll keep the ledger and then call me over. Now then, once again, Aww. welcome Link. Do you need to register a horse or take one out for a ride? Uh, let's take horse. Oh. And let's take Gary. Uh, yes, take out Gary. Good old Gary, man. You, you gotta love Gary. Gary's the best. Ah, oh. Gary. Oh. Uh, no, leave that harness on Gary. Gary's oh. our boy. Okay, mm. okay, 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 okay. Huh. Dude, we know all this. Okay, let's go. Come on, we're just trying to do one thing at a time here. Jeez, and then you gotta bombard me with 90 different things. Oh my gosh, Gary! Come here, Gary. <laughs> oh no! Good enough. Let's go, Gary. Oh. <laughs> Stop! I just want to get on Gary. Uh, oh no! Stop it, let me off. I'm falling. This is it. Uh, what's happening? Help! Oh my god. Do we have to start all over? Oh my lord, I didn't even know that could happen! What the hell? Sheesh. Oh. <laughs> Alright, round two. We got him connected good this time. Alright, no tip in the wagon. Here we go. Oh my gosh, I say that. Look what I do. No tip in the wagon! Oh my gosh, this, that blind beast. I wonder if we can take it. Do you think we can take it? We won't know. We'll know after this. Come on, Gary! He's got max out full of power. Let's go, Gary. Gary's got this, no problem. Gary, you the horse. Gary's got four horsepower. Oi! Oh, great fairy! The stable trotters have arrived. We've done it. You have our thanks. You have taken us right to where we needed to be. All right, everyone, no time to dwaddle. Strike up the band. Our audience is Great Fairy herself. Let's do it. Any day now. Let's go. Let's hear some stable trotting. Great Fairy has returned to us. This, this is one of the greatest days of my life. Uh, the Great Fairy herself enjoyed my humble horn playing. What a day. What a divine presence. What splendor. I will remember this moment all my life. Oh. We can't hang around here all day. We must return to the stable and share the good news. Yeah, yeah. Thank you again which leaves only your reward. Now, 
Don't be shy. Oh man. Yeah, yeah. Look at that, we're up to two grand. Oopsie, that's left the old wallet pretty light, but there's no excuse to skimp on our things. A clear conscience is worth every rupee. Yeah, yeah. The captivating Maja is now at peace. But she wasn't the only great fairy shut away in her flower bud. Oh. That's why the show must go on. The next great fairy hiding place. Oh yes, I'll borrow this horse so that I can get to the next destination. Oh. <laughs> but it won't cause it, you any trouble. We do the responsible thing and return your steed to to a stable, don't worry. Yeah, yeah. Well then, good traveler, thank you again. Complete. Mm -hmm. So you're the one who arranged those soothing sounds for me. I would have liked to be released by someone bigger, but... <laughs> She's rude. Oh. Well, a slim little lad like you is fine too, I suppose. Oh. It seems the world is not so corrupted as I thought. To thank you for opening my eyes. I can enhance your clothing, but of course I require the necessary materials to do it. Oh. With the power I have available to me, I can greatly enhance your clothing. And hands away. Mm. Oh, we can't do nothing. This is what I figured. Uh, so we need some black bacoblin. Oh, blue bacoblin horns. Blue bacoblin horns. All right. Uh, we need one more black bacoblin horn. And 20 ambers. Man, I've just been selling those. Jeez. Okay, in this game, you legit have to save your stuff. For sure. Trousers of time? Wow, you can upgrade these. Uh, can you upgrade this? No, nope, cannot enhance this item. <laughs> we need rubies for that. We know where to get rubies. We can buy rubies. Uh, but we don't need that. So what we really need is, uh, black bacoblin horns and those amber shards. Blue bacoblin horns. Black bacoblin horns and amber shards. Okay, because that's really what I'm after. And of course, the Lionel Horns have Razor Shrooms. Lionel Mace Horn. Okay. Well, hopefully he drops a few of each. Let's go take him out. <laughs> and on that note, uh, I will see you guys next episode. Hopefully we're standing in front of a Lionel, getting ready to whoop its butt. Peace out, bye.